Hello everyone, good morning. Today we are leaving for Las Vegas. Hi, Kuya Jonjo. Hi, welcome to my vlog. Ayun, siya po yung natin namin yesterday. <laughs> So ayun, today we are going to Las Vegas. We'll be staying there for three days and we'll travel four hours for today. So we're just unpacking and then we're leaving. I'm just gonna wear my shoes. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye. Vegas, we're going to the Seven Magic Mountains and then we're going to head now to Las Vegas Anyways, it's gonna be a long walk from here but it's there already So yeah 100 I'm not going to rocks are not here, I can't put it Let's try. Try this. Try this one. This. Nice. <laughs> Hey, Kuya Aster. Hello, hello. I think the when the place where the season 18 Hell's Kitchen winner will be of the head chef. I don't know if this was the place, but if this was the place, I think Ariel is currently is currently being the chef there. I don't know, but I'm such a fan of my gosh. It's so bright. And I think the fountain show is I think over there. Over there. Over over there, I think. That's where it is. And you could see the planet out here. And everything. That's so cool. But I think beside there is Caesar's palace or something. Look at that. Look at that view. Oh my gosh. Every 15 minutes daw mga ganun. Every 15 minutes this happens. This pretty stuff right here. Right now I am oh I have been always surprised that this hotel is very famous and it's very big. Uh, it really surprised my expectations. Oh. So I'll show you guys the room as usual. Again, there's, there's a lot of room tours in here. Expected a lot. So here is the bathroom as we enter the bathroom. And the bathtub. And we have two mirrors this time. Very fancy. A toilet and a shower. It's really big. We go and here are our two 
bedroom, so it's very dark at the moment. And we have our television over there with our with our Fiji water. And I you and you do. Hello everyone. I didn't bring my camera today because we're going to a acrobatic show called Ka and I might not be allowed to bring in my camera, so I just opt for my phone instead. So we're going to an Uber right now. Yes, my Uber. What? My first Uber here in in America, in the U.S. On the way there, since it's just quite near. Actually, I did a thought that the show is tomorrow, as I said a while ago, but it is actually yesterday. I'm such a clown! Oh my god. Hello everyone, I just washed myself and we just went home from the MGM Grand Stadium to watch Ka, which is a acrobatic show. Yes, the reason that I wasn't able to really record the, the footage of the performance is because number one is a theatric show and it is a rule to not use your cell phone and to photograph and videograph. Because at the start of the performance, they have this little skit actually that presents that you're not allowed to throw the cell phone because the, or else the actor will throw it in a pit of fire and your soul will be there too. <laughs> it's really pretty good actually, it's pretty like, funny and intense actually. It's scary that my parents were like, bawal yan, bawal yan. When I entered the, the theater where they will perform, I was actually, first thought coming to my head was the infinity multi dem infinity multi-dimensional fortress from Kimetsu no Yai, but I think it's because of the it's because of the color of the lighting and the way it's structured it somehow reminded me of that anyways what as, as the show progresses it's like all about twins who are trying who are improving their swordsmanship and and win their village in their tribe there is this sword play there, there's sword play and sports swordsmanship between the twins and also the village tribe between them and then there's another tribe with all tattoos and stuff on the other side they these two tribes are not really getting along and stuff and also there's this love story where one tri one person falls in love with the other from the other tribe and stuff yada yada unfortunately i slept on some parts because i was just really sleepy like i just arri arrived at 5 p.m. I took a nap from 6 to 8 just to prepare myself and I'm still uh, groggy and sleepy as, you sh as I said a while ago so I really apologize for not really watching it but what I love about the show is that the theatrics and the, fl and the gracefulness of the show the way they are synchronized and everything and the way that they use the stage in order to make dynamic scenes to create a a feel that you are really you are really in that scene i love the finale as well that they created pyrotechnics and all this stuff i love the costume quality it's very very good i wanted to buy a program pamphlet thingy so that i could look over again but I don't know, it's very ex I think it's very expensive and my parents wouldn't allow that. So anyways, we went home now and it's, I don't know what time it is, it's 12.11am, uh, I am in the morning here. And the reason that I'm alone in the room right now for the first time in my life is because my parents, my cousins are all downstairs doing the casino and since I'm still 19, I'm not allowed to do that sadly. Once I'm 21, uh, manda kayo dyan, charot. But anyways, Vegas has been a ride so far and I'm excited to see what more I could visit tomorrow and I'm just gonna stay here, spend my time alone for a while and probably eat some chicken before I sleep, I don't know. So, um, I'll see you guys at the next day of our Vegas trip. We're here at the hotel day two Today we are going to just walk around in Las Vegas since we already watched the show yesterday. Hi Hi Aston. Hi Aston. Say hi. Say hi, hi. to the car. <laughs> okay <Say I'm> 
is that it? <laughs> Anyways, we are just going downstairs right now. No, he's saying something. <laughs> and we're just going to walk around. I know. And get gelato. Gelato is something that I want to taste actually. And I'm really excited. I think this is a garden display since it's Christmas ho holiday team winter wonderland team this is where it happens or elves and everything and uh, and the display here is massively superior also the reason that I am alone right now is because well technically Ate Let Let had to take care of Aston and Aston kept running and kept saying hi to strangers and it's adorable it's like He's like touching someone's grandpa and then the family said hi and actually everyone's really nice here even though you touch it's like they're trying to be friendly especially when you have a baby on board and it was fun really fun also the the, the places where you can take pictures in is so good I am fat um, I am it, it's so speechless oops there's so many people here actually We just left our hotel recently and we're on our way to Arizona to see the Grand Canyon. I don't know what to say actually. It's been a repeat of every day. We go somewhere for two hours again. The, the time there is such two hours ahead so it will be in another state from Nevada to Arizona. There will be lots of sights and I hope we have so much fun. Here now at the Hoover Dam with family. So Hoover Dam is that away, and we're heading there now. It's really cute. Look at the Hoover Dam, the road, or the Hoover Dam, and everything. It's really big. The massive flight proudly displays the American flag and the banner of the Department of the
right now we're supposed to go to the Grand Canyon but my parents said that they were too tired now sadly since they were tired recently actually I understand because we have been traveling all around for the past two weeks it's really draining really tiring and so after that our supposedly one day of rest didn't happen because I didn't na cancel the flight namin so they were really tired, it really took a toll of them a little bit, so we decided to cancel the trip to the Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon. Anyways, I'm just waiting for them. They're just, you know, they're just having a break. They're taking pictures. I am also staying here because I feel like I'm tired as well, actually. <laughs> so I will talk to you guys later, and we're just going to go home. And then when I get home back to Corona, California, I'm just going to edit pictures. Probably start editing the videos as well, who knows? Or maybe even draw a little bit. Or maybe we watch the season 4 Haikyuu PV all over again because I'm going to die because of that, so I swear to god. I'm gonna talk to you guys.